Hello everybody, welcome back to Path of Exile, Atlas of Worlds, with me Transfat. As you can see, it's still very dark, because we did things. Just kind of amusing, because, you know, these random people, it's probably not dark for them. But, we will travel to the caverns, like our quest thing is telling us to do. Continue on with our quest. And undo what we did, or at least try to. I, uh, between episodes, I... Sold all my superior stuff. I actually have a good selection of, uh... <laughs> Tear knock the Brain Eater. Oh, hey there. Um... Yeah, sold all my superior stuff, um... Got a different mana flask. Some other stuff. Wow, th this is all quite obnoxious. Can I get you to die? There we go. Rather fitting that they dropped summon skeletons. So we got a, a nice all, oh, huh? That's all right. Adds 3 to 22 physical damage, 15 to strength, 12 to dexterity, 13 increased attack speed, 20% increased damage with movement skills, 15% increased attack speed with movement skills, 15% reduced accuracy rating. There are two things to know about fighting when to swing like crazy and when to run. Yeah, no one to hold them. But yeah, summon skeletons. Self-explanatory. Not useful to us. But I'll pick it up anyway, because I'm a klepto. It doesn't take up much space. Okay. I think this is a long dungeon, so this episode might be a little long. Might be. Possibly. Open this? No. Okay. But yeah, um, I have so many blacksmith uh, whetstones. Oh, okay, so that's the next floor. Uh, I want to explore just a little bit more, despite what I was just saying. Because there should be, uh, should be good stuff there. Or somewhere around here. Actually, um, that was probably the, uh, the, um, invasion boss. Yeah, that's probably what that was. The thing that dropped the nice all. So that's what that was probably about. So, now we just have to find the, uh, like physical damage support. Okay, it's fine. Not useful for us, but hey. We need to find the strong box. Or the... Because it's gonna be a nice one, too. Alright. Extra damage with whatever skill I have that is attached to. Also, actually completed a stack of Identify Scrolls. Oh, I'm actually taking damage. Look at that. Wild. Look at that. I don't know what you did, but don't do it. Very rude. Okay, thank you, Ballista. You are the Ballista of us. This, I don't know. That's a dumb joke. I'm so, I'm sorry. Uh, I just want to be entertaining. Oh yes, you're right, right, right. I'm remembering the, uh... Cruel Walker the Ruthless. Okay. Seems a little redundant. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm remembering that this, uh... This floor is made up of these small dead end rooms off the main thing. That's what that's about. I was gonna say miss me, but I didn't. But they didn't, I mean. Yep. I was superior for a second there. But yeah, we are in a pyramid. So the floors will get shorter. As we go up. As you... Well, just visualize the pyramid, you know? And remember to to visualize that whenever we come up to the top of it, because there's something about this that always bothered me. Kill packs from these bloodlines. Okay. Okay, this looks significant. Angry agony shrieker. Okay. Well, that wasn't so bad. Mm 
Okay. Eh, uh, that's... I, well, no, I, I didn't see the strong box yet. Damn it. Pain spy and the malignant. <laughs> fantasy games are silly. Oh boy. I'm not a big fantasy fan. Maybe thinking, well, why are you playing this? I, I, I could stand dark fantasy because it tends to take itself a little more seriously. But I, uh, I like, I like sci-fi. Uh, cyberpunk's my favorite. You know, the sp spacefaring sci-fi is all right. I think it gets a little goofy sometimes. Wow. Hmm. Very nice. I accept. I'm on level 27. Oh, one more and then we can get this. Deadly draw. Um. Huh. I don't think attack speed. The attack speed affect skills or that cast speed. I don't remember. Hmm. 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 I don't know. It doesn't seem as, as useful as the one in the other branch. But I've made my decision. Oh, chromatic. I mean, they are very generous with the refund points, so that's fine. Where is the friggin' strongbox? Like, really? Being very rude. Old gloves. I don't know, the, the mundane items always seem amusing to me. Unless, does it mean this whole building? Like, there's it spawns somewhere in this whole, like, dungeon? Because after I go down here, I think that's the whole floor ex explored, really. That would only slow me down. Me, 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 me. Yeah, that's... That looks like pretty much the whole floor explored. Well, I'll be able to tell once uh, we change areas. Because if there's a loading screen, then it actually, you know, loads a level. If not, then it just moved to the next one. Like in the last episode, when I was in the spider cave, it did that. Can't remember if it does that. But just in case, I'm going to put, um, do I want silver coins? A breach ambush? Ambush League Stone. Wait, that's what I have, right? Yeah. That's what I'm looking for, because it has the additional rare item uh, modifier on it, which is nice. Um, yeah, let's go with this. Sure. Oh, this does have a loading screen. Huh. So there must have been a, uh, a strong box somewhere on that floor. Oh well. I'm not gonna lose any sleep over it. Oh hey. Could you, could you maybe not do that? Here, have some of that. Beyond. Saying enemies close together in the next area will attract monsters from beyond this realm. I don't know what that means, but it sounds fun. You're a jerk, getting in the way like that. <laughs> huh. Kinda want that. Yeah, so it did use a charge of that to, to make this uh this area. Level 30. Okay, three more levels and I could fit the three uh League stones, that's nice. Alright. Okay, these are Hernandez mobs. You guys are really obnoxious. You should consider not being so obnoxious. Just very loud. I want loud enemies. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Electric skeletons amuse me. What a concept. Yes. 
Yes, I, I will take all these things. You know, I, I've just been so good with taking... Oh, okay, there's the exit. So good with uh, using my... Uh, my superior items and getting those stones and stuff. I should probably start using them. Now they work in a weird way. So depending on the rarity of the item you use them on, it it uh, determines what the percentage. Ooh, bone bow, three slots. Uh, yeah. Oops, that's not what I wanted. We're looking for a bone bow, with three slots. I'm gonna have to connect them manually though. There was some with two slots in the uh, the store. Um. Yeah, so if it's a normal item, each each uh, like buff stone thing will add five percent to its quality, um, and then I think it's three for magic, and then one for rare, and the other one. <laughs> that would only slow me down. Um. So to get the most use out of them, you you buff up a normal item, and then you use like an orb of chance or or uh, the other one makes it a rare. And uh, hope for the best. At least that's my understanding. Deer skin gloves. I I have no. I'm good. I'm good. But you can probably tell by the shape of this this floor already that it, how large it isn't. You do all your magic and stuff. And, and you. Yeah. Oh, uh, there's a... One of these. Oh, no, no, no. Shoot the thing that keeps them alive. There we go. Alrighty, um... I'm actually gonna go back and uh, stash some stuff. So I'll be back in just a moment. Alrighty, back at it. Grab these slippers. Okay. Um. Yeah, I guess I'll take a poke over here. Speed up some. Oh, hey there. Check that out. Jagged foil does not sound useful. Oh, so why are they foils, not rapiers? Foils are fencing swords. Rapiers are the actual ones that are designed to do damage. It's kind of weird to me. Okay. A whammer. Almost chromatic. Not quite. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what I wanted to see. Mm I have so many scrolls of identify. Um, I don't have any of my currency items to like change it stats. Well, apparently explodes. Ah, oh, there's a friggin' this thing. we go. Jackasses. I'm actually taking some damage. Bombo. There we go. Okay, so I guess I'll just boogie out to the, uh, the end of this floor. I got the added thingies. Oh, no, that's, I want to go this way. Okay. So I got the, uh, the, the lead stone thingamajigs. I see you, Skeleton. I just don't care. That's how disinterested I am in you right now. I don't remember how many floors there are. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, that worked. Okay, so this one didn't even load. So this one must be a tiny floor then. You can see the map there. Grinning totem, huh? <laughs> You're not grinning anymore, buddy. I do appreciate a good grin. I'm a fan.
fan of the Cheshire Cat. Hmm. Apparently that sword is made of two hands. Interesting. Oh boy. I should not be allowed near your microphone. Those shields are so shiny. They seem kind of out of place considering how dingy everything else is. Like, did someone just give these skeletons shiny new shields? Very, very lovely necromancers out there somewhere. Ugh. Oh, I managed to get through that. That's nice. Also, I like how the, the, the electrical skeletons, um, like, like, like crackle and stuff. Um, yeah, it's got the same exact same slots as what I have. I'll, uh, so I'll get that and maybe try, um, enchant it or whatever. Not sure if that's going to be worth it, though. Because as you may have guessed from when I looked at the map earlier, Agony Slash, uh, we're coming to the end of this act. And, uh... May also have noticed I'm actually taking damage now, so uh, I think I mentioned it earlier. Well, not earlier this episode, but in the previous episode, that uh, Act Three is when things start getting a little nasty. Like depending on your build, it's it's when you could expect to get one shotted. Yeah, at least what happened to me. But I tend to play squishy classes, so okay. So we're almost done this floor. Just want that, uh, what is it? Oh no, th this is, what am I doing? This is, yeah, this is still considered the same area because we didn't load a new area. I'm a moron, I apologize. That was, that was real dumb. But, I'll make it up to you, I think this is the uh, next area. And something I haven't been doing for bosses is leaving a portal. I should be doing. Yep, can't level it up though. Alright, get some of that. Mm hmm. You know, for being a pyramid, it uh, doesn't really have uh, what I would think of as, as like pyramid esque interior. Like, it's not like. Egyptian pyramids, it's not like ziggurats or anything, it just seems to be like, like quasi-gothic. I mean, I suppose there's some Aztec hints to it. Maybe, a little bit. I mean, I know it's, it doesn't have to be related to those cultures or anything, but... <laughs> it's a thing. Okay, the Apex. This is where I wanted to put this. I don't actually remember what elements the boss uses. Oh well. The Dark Altar. Well, I guess we have to activate it. Actually, I think I remember now. Uh, yeah, we're good. Pretty sure it does lightning damage. Ah, stuff is happening! Hi there. Alright. Bunch of ads. Get out of here. Oh, I'm just gonna brush it down. I know, I'm the worst. Get some stacks, I guess. I like this music. 
I, I don't remember if the last time I played if they had this nice music. It could have just been I, I turned off the music because I would watch YouTube videos while playing games. Because that's how I mostly play games. Unless sound is very important. Like, uh, like Rainbow Six Siege. Yay! I did a thing. Now you're dead. Silver Flask. Follow the ring. Grant Life Flask. No? Maybe like that. Spread the word amongst your kind, Nightmare. You're not welcome in my world. Yeah. That's nice. Like that. What's a silver flask do? That's knock back to melee attacks. That is not useful to me. Not even a little bit. Okay. Well, the exit is over here. So, keep in mind, we're in a pyramid, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Makes sense of that. Yeah. Waypoint. There we go, we got a new map. Act three. It's weird, this one doesn't really have a quest to go back to the last one. At least right away. Alright, so. Remember what I said about getting one-shotted? I remember quite often getting one-shotted by, like, unique versions of those enemies. These ones. They're nasty. They're like little assassins. I think they intentionally have one around in this area just to kill new players. They're like, a lot of these targets, they're like one one-on-one one hit. You know? Get out of here. Mm, shit beetles. Strength and dexterity. Nope. Do not want. Boulder? Hey, look at that. Had a bombo. It's probably the nicest thing I've, I've seen on Rim Boulder ever. Ah. You're just doing work. Get out of here. I'm kind of being cautious here. Okay. Oh, stuff happening over there. Just, just gonna fire over there. Flayed warrior. I think they're beyond flayed. They're, they're, they're kind of skeletal. Oh, it's like a it's like a cockatrice or something. Oh, I've seen these guards before. Guard captain, huh? Uh oh. That would only slow Oops. me down. Uh those are chromatic. That's fine. I think I have enough those okay, level ups. What are you two doing down there? You having fun? Just like open this and stop them from rising. I'm not really sure how that works. Could you could you could you stay dead? Oh, it's because they're near it. Okay, it's because they were stuck. Like I was supposed to rescue her, but she's just kind of chilling there. Stop reviving, you sh shipbirds! All right, come on, come over here then. Ugh, not fair enough. Come here. I, I really don't understand. Nope, that wasn't far enough. I seen the beam go. Or was it? Okay, it was far enough. Okay, that's fine. Clarissa. Hello, Clarissa. Could, could you... Have it. I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but we've no time for talk. 
Tolman was out here with me, and now... Piety has him. They're headed for the crematorium. I have no chance against Piety and your blackguards, but you... You're another matter entirely. Please. You found it in your heart to rescue me. Tolman is just as worthy of your generosity. I mean, you were kind of in the way. Technically. Thunder. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Coins. Scrolls. I bet. Ooh. Uh, nah. I'll take that fork, or the, the three slot connected boots. But, um, oh. I think we're, I think we're gonna start getting, uh, nicer items. Okay. Ancient graffiti. Mortality is the mother of life. We have turned our backs on her. Okay. Well, Siren Encampment. Which kind of reminds me of Act uh, 2 in Diablo 2. Yeah. So that's nice. I do like me some Diablo 2. That map is kind of hard on the eyes. <laughs> I apologize. So... Tendency plaque. Oh, we got three of them. Oops. But lots of people to talk to. Our paths meet in the shell of a long dead snail. An empire slow to see where its path was taking it. Built on the husk of another and destined to be buried time and time again. This city will see great things yet, Exile. But not in your lifetime. I'm fine. You like that. Fateful. Madame Oabadua welcomes you here, to this village of circumstance. As you can well appreciate, we Exiles make our homes wherever a class allows us to. Although we all here harbor different beliefs, see you with different eyes, we are united in our thanks for returning Clarissa to us. She is the gentle heart of this place. A spirit still capable of love in this wasteland of hatred. Yet, that gentle heart remains in jeopardy. Piety and her blackguard still have Tolman. And although he isn't deserving of Clarissa, she'll not smile until he's by her side. You have the walk, the grace, of a woman who knows death intimately. Men are born with that knowledge. We have to earn it. So from one woman to another, I ask for your help, Ranger. Please, find Tolman for us. That's sexist. Be well. <laughs> Hergen. Whoever you are, I have to thank you for returning Clarissa to us. Problem is, one though I love her ain't much good to anyone. Like gloves, they tend to be more useful than peers. The missing glove in this case is a young fella named Tolman. We'd be ever so grateful if you could find him for us. Sure. Alright, so he's a blacksmith. Boil bow. Hmm. Wow. That looks okay. 40% <laughs> increased elemental damage. Got some four slot bone bolt bone bows though. Which is very tempting, but we have the next bow up. Ooh, that's rather nice too. Hmm. Yep. Broadheads. Might be worth getting and enchanting. At some point. Full leather, that's our new body armor. Which I don't see why I shouldn't get, really. Hmm. Well, we'll go talk to other people first. Hmm. Will we? Alright, there's Clarissa. She has nothing to say to us. But, uh. Wait, I don't remember this. Sorry, what's one sec? I don't remember. Oh, it's not a bridge, it's a dock. Okay. <laughs> I thought it was the bridge going to a new area. I haven't been before. Keep your distance, exile. The name's Grigor. 
And when you've had your eyes fill of my twisted visage, how about you turn those fine jellies of yours eastward? Yes, you've brought Clarissa home to us. And once again, I see she pesters me with pity. <clears throat> There's only so much broth, so many bouquets that a man can take. For a criminal, Clarissa has a strangely soft center. Still, I'd rather not see that heart of hers harden. See if you can find that lost boy mate of hers. With him around, Clarissa doesn't have as much time to bother me. Sounds like a lovely individual. Also, you can kind of see the, the bone there. How is that foot getting blood? Goodbye. And goodbye. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to be saying goodbye to you folks because that's going to be it for this episode. If you like this episode, want to give it a like, a comment, or constructive criticism. And if you want more, why not subscribe? Either way, thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed yourself, and I hope to see you next time. Stay spicy.